Hello, Martin Baker here from Baker's Garden Buildings. I'm over in Fleet in Hampshire. I wanted to show you this two building project we completed a few months ago. Started with this client a couple of years back, in fact, and gone from there. The building in this video I'm gonna focus on is the Merlin Gym. You're looking in front of you. There'll be another video, which I'll show you in a moment, of the stone clad um, hot tub room that's sitting over there. So for this building, it is five meters wide um, and around about 4.7 meters deep. Technically, this is the front of property. It's kind of to the side, a bit of a, a odd shaped garden in that respect. So um, we did seek planning on this. And because of that, we've gone for a nice big apex shape. And one of the reasons is, is that the client um, wants to practice um, aerial af athletics. So we've actually put a big apex hoop in there, which is really exciting. Um, gym and storage for this building. It was what it's all about. Been part of a huge garden development. It's so beautiful here. Um, they've. Uh, really redevelop the whole garden. But let me show you around this one here. So we've got the MTX cladding um, in the anthracite colour. You can see that lovely gable glass that we've got into this um, this Merlin, which I really, really like. Two full drop windows on the side. And can you see there's a door there into the outside? I'll show you that in a moment, what that's all about. Um, as we run around the building, we've got the canopy out the front, uh, really nicely done. And the reason we went for that Merlin is for this hoop. So we've actually designed um, uh, like the strop system that actually runs all the way over the joists um, and is working absolutely brilliantly. Um, so these clients, uh, you know, real, real big athletes here, they do long distance uh, riding and for their training, they've got the two watt bikes set up. There is a bit more equipment that's gonna come into this building, but for now, running machine, watt bikes, and then a number of cupboards you'll see behind us. So here we've got what is a part of a storage cupboard um, yeah, just quite quite a simple one, um, and that really does um, match with the, build, the the room over there. Now, this what this is here is a cassette toilet. Um, you may have seen these before for me. This is a non plumbed in toilet. So there's a cassette the other side, but also we've got that door which you can see from the side. It's called what we call Jack and Jill. So that means that the gardeners can come in and use this um, when when they're away. Um, or when they're doing the garden work. The cupboard's built by us, and in here we've got all of the comms, toilet stuff, plus all of these Wi-Fi zones. So each one of those little zones there, you can actually turn them on and off here actually by using this, but they are Wi-Fi receivers, and that controls all of the lighting um, in this garden room, and we've done all of the garden lighting as well, which is really exciting. Um, got away from the regular convector heating, so they don't need it to be really warm in here as a gym. So we've actually got that down with this lovely electric oil-filled radiator. Got a little thermostat down there, and that just keeps it at a nice temperature. Probably not enough if you want to use this as like an office um, for the depths of the winter, but, but, but good enough. Um, inside here, we've got all of that lovely void of the apex put a light into this big covered space. And this was all designed about um, heights, which is gonna have um, storage of more gym equipment that's to come. So there's still quite a few bits to come um, for this project, uh, this building, which I might come back again in the winter and show you. Single fan light window on that side there, and then all that lovely light that flows in through the gable glass and then the glass round onto these, uh, the two big full drop windows um, with that. Uh, gone with um, our friends at Berwick's with a, a candine floor um, in a kind of slate grey finish. I really like that. Uh, we've actually matched that with the um, the building, the other building there, with a waterproof version of that as well. Um, yeah, so there we go. If I kind of come back round here for you and show you that again. So there you go. So there's a lovely Apex gym. Um, not fully kitted out yet, but uh, won't, won't be long before it's fully finished. Love to come back and show you this in the winter, uh, in the dark with all of the lighting. So I'm going to do that. Um, and if you're interested in these kind of clever designs, say that that aerial um, link and the strop was something that we've designed and really proud of. And it may be the solution for you. Um, any kind of garden gym is always um, you know, a, a great asset to a property. So if this kind of garden building is of interest, give us a shout. Um, thank you for watching. Keep up to date with our social media. Please like, subscribe and share and let me know your thoughts on this. Thank you.